ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, pirates of all ages. We are back with number like something or other in this sequence of what did we find in this $7,000 storage unit. It is amazing the things that we have found so far. Watch the videos coming. This is just this is a load of amazing tools. This is just tools and fishing stuff. And I haven't even put a dent in this storage unit right here. If you look right here, we're only this far into it. I got the really cool stuff right here. You have to check out the other videos. And we are just going to continue on unboxing. There's the halfway marker, that board there. We're not even there yet. This marker right here marks the halfway spot. But we're not halfway because we still have to do all this whole wall too. So much stuff in this unit. It's unbelievable. Well worth the seven grand I paid. At the end of this, there will be a reveal of everything I thought was cool. So when we get done with all the unboxings, I'm gonna have one big recap. Can't wait. Anyway, let's get busy. Oh yeah, don't forget the like button, the share button, and say something pretty like, Pirate, I'm glad you had the nerve to go all in on seven grand and bring us these great videos because this unit was the best I've ever seen on YouTube. This is something we have not seen yet in this unit, and that is artwork for the most part. So let's see what we have in here. I'm interested to see some crazy artwork. I saw Vargas books. Be some Varguses. What we have here is this mirror right here. Rat poop everywhere. That's disgusting. I shouldn't even touch that. It's like rat poop and pee all inside of that. Then we have this artwork here. I think this is a copy. It says A. Sebring, but if you look at it, it's kind of like a painting with glaze to make it look real. And then there's another one in here that's a mirror. Nothing special. Not as exciting as I was hoping to be. <laughs> wow. That's primitive. I gotta get that looked at. Once again, a million, million, million things to get looked at in this one. Another one. What do we know about these? I don't know nothing. That's two. Look at the... That's three of them. Are those Native American? Am I uh, not understanding something here? in this one. Survival gear. Mm. It's the box I like to see. Cheap. This bowl. What is this? See yawn. That is nice right there. This is what Japanese or Chinese or something? I don't know. That seems really expensive right there. Carrying on Rosenthal. <laughs> Rosenthal Heart signed. Oh, this is nice. There's one. There's two. Two hearts are better than one. She only knew. Oh, that's what she does to mine. She smashes it. Ooh, if she only knew, two hearts are better than one. Nice. Full cake decorative pan. No real marking on the bottom. Cracked. Let's see if we can get it in here. Hold on a sec. In Waterford. I see a marking. Nice bowl right there. Plate bowl. And it's not a plate, it's a bowl. No marking. Really well made. Really nice clock right here. It's missing a screw. I didn't see it in the box anywhere, but. We can easily fix that. Made in Germany. I don't want to 
I mess this up. Order really well made. Looks like a Jaeger Liqueur at most, kind of. The movement's messed up from being out. Very nice cloth, though. We'll have to have that looked at for sure. Don't know. I just know it's really nice. Got etched glass. We have several of these colored glass wine glasses here. Flowers. A shooting trophy. Some uh, miscellaneous stuff. And to me, what I think is possibly the coolest thing in here is this right here. Because this looks handmade. It looks Native American, possibly. And we have so much Native American stuff. We have to have something like that looked at because that is nice. Oh, yeah. And this one, too. Look at this. Guys, I don't even... I'm so bewildered. Look, we just got all this to go. I don't even know what's in here. It's just nuts. Absurd. What could be in here? What could be in here? So these tiny pictures. Every box is like the most crazy. Like this is Native American? I have no idea. It's crazy old. Civil War? No. What do we got here? Some words. A Jim Bowie. That's nice. Allison Art Acres. Gene W. Allison. It's a big print of all the fishes in the world right there. Wow, look at these guys. This is some form of an original photo here that's been framed. You could see, I don't know nothing about this, but this right here intrigues me. Very weird. You can see the cracking in the black and white. You come over here and you see that that is taken off. It's a black and white. That's an original photo. A little bit of damage, but who are all these guys? Is there anybody special? That is a big team. Wow. I'm just, I'm so speechless. Clap. Brook Trout. Paul W. Hitchcock. Paul W. Hitchcock. Have to take a look at that one. I have here, let's start going through the art now. Finishing up, I pulled it all out. Some type of photography print. Steve Johnson 04. Pretty nice. I would love my house to be right here and then that's my whole view. That would be dope. I would be really happy with that. I thought this was pretty cool. It's a print, but look at these guys trying to catch a great wide or whatever it is they're catching. They just got all the fishes right there. They're just going to town catching fish. This is something that needs to be looked up. What Jackie Moore 1985. Maybe not, maybe I'm tripping. Kind of cool. No COA or nothing. This looks inexpensive. Thompson, just your standard little art print. And yeah, that's it for the art. This saw right here. What is that? 150 maybe? Maybe 150, I don't know. It's going to be hard to tell. The stuff is just crazy up in here. Tools have been really good. Well, bust my buttons. This thing right here is about brand new. Electric chainsaw home light, 12 amp.
fishing supplies. Wow. I'm getting a little running out of speed. I don't know what to do. So I said, I'm going to cut into a box, right? I'm like right here. I said, I'm going to cut into a box because I just don't want to take one off the top. It's just like two dark spiders everywhere. What comes out of this? Let's see here. <laughs> oh my God. Hmm, that's brand new. Nice. Right angle drill. Sorry for slamming that. That's gotta be some money right there. What's that, like 150 bucks? Right there? <laughs> oh man. Ooh, that's like another 150 right there, I think. I think I can sell this for 150. Not positive. Heavy portable cable saw blades. That is a nice piece right there. Like new. Hmm, this has been used a little bit. I can still see in that beam 80 bucks though right there. You don't want to underestimate it because it is a great, great tool, but you can see the oil being used, whatever he did. Ooh, what is this? Hilti DX A41. This I haven't seen before. Gonna imagine that's money too. Hilti stands for at least a hundred dollar bill. In my eyes, starts with an H. Maybe two hundred bucks right here. I don't know if I'm looking it up, but a DXA forty one. <laughs> this is just oh my god. All fishing, all tools, all tools, 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 tools. Expensive fishing equipment. Nothing but tools and fishing equipment. Just that's just what's in here right now. And I'm still like literally a fraction into the unit. Uh, this is all the amazing stuff, uh, crazy stuff. I got a whale's tooth right here, dude. This is crazy, look. There's a whale's tooth, there's a polar bear skull, all sorts of like antique this. Harold says this is like a thousand dollar knife. Everything you can think of. I still have, there's the halfway marker of the unit. That's halfway there, but none of this has been gone through. From here behind this cabinet, everything, nothing's been touched yet. A bag, a bag, a camelback bag, a slingshot, an American flag just kind of rustled in there. And that is rat poop you see jumping around. A scene from the beach. That's kind of neat. Doesn't look like silver, but we definitely want to get it checked out. Ooh. Hmm. Interesting. There's a pair. Nope. Possible silver mirror there. Too much stuff to get looked at. I shouldn't say too much, but there's a lot. Suspenders, dual Indiana Trading, India tra in a Traded Company. This is something. What do you got here? Board game? No. Just like every box, guys. Gloves. Mortar and pestle. Seems like it's an expensive one. 
It's still cool. American flag. Some type of Gore-Tex gloves. Mm. Okay. I like this flag because I don't think I've ever seen this one. Look at this. 76. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 stars. This is a nice flag right here. Pioneer Valley Forge Flag Company. I like that. This one's marked Master Bedroom. An expensive travel kit. Hats. It's a nice wallet. Come back to that after we look through everything else. <laughs> I just don't even know where to begin with all this stuff, guys. I just keep stacking it up over here. That's all I keep doing. Everything good. I just keep stacking it. It's empty. Nothing. Nothing. Leather pouch. What is this? My first piece of jewelry I found. Broken here. Ooh. Oh. I thought these hats were cool. Kavanaugh Hats, New York, and ELB Lang Rock. Those are nice hats right there. Not to mention, we found this really cool perfume bottle in that box. It's not marked, but I like it. It feels like a heart. And then we got these two Sterling Silver candlestick holders made by Sterling Reinforced. Those are nice, too. Like, it just keeps adding up. Everything is adding up, adding up, adding up. I feel like we're getting close to seven grand, if not possibly seven grand, because I have no idea... And half the stuff that I have. Look, it's just stacking up. I don't even have to do with it right now. Marco Polo. Come on, $100,000. Nope, nothing there. Nothing there. Not in there either. Bummer. This tools. I thought this was going to be a good box. Some cheap tools. <laughs> oh man, what's in here? Oh, yep, great, good stuff. Filthy power actuated tool, a DX four fifty one. I don't even know. It's another, in my eyes, $100 bill. Fishing equipment, fishing equipment, fishing equipment. This must be his lower, lower end fishing equipment. Empty boxes. Nice. That unit right here is becoming a dream. That's a wrap on this one, guys. Uh, I don't even know what to say. Like, if you guys, make sure you watch all the videos in this sequence, starting from when it says, uh, the first one 
till now and then more. There's so much more to go. I don't even know how many videos are gonna have total in this one, but this unit is going to be a dream come true. This unit's nuts. I'm not even halfway through. I think double my money is gonna be a walk in the park. Salt Princess ain't even seen nothing in there. I think she's scared because of the Black Widow that I told her about. She ain't been back in there since. There, there's there's other black widows, but don't trip. There's rats. There's all. I touched a, a dead rat or bird or something. It was like a skull, a whole thing. But don't forget to uh, keep checking out these videos. Like, share, subscribe. Tell everybody you love them, girl. Well, gotta go eat. Why are we at dinner tonight? I'll tell you why. We are celebrating this young lady today. Got accepted by YouTube to be monetized, and we're just all around proud. We're out here wearing matching shirts, doing the father daughter thing. Some chocolate shakes, about to eat our favorite burgers, Bud Ruffles, celebrating this young lady. She's still camera shy, even though she's a YouTube star.